What is good, YouTube? I am back for another video. And in this video, you can already see, we got Cody Bellinger. And as you can see in my outfield, I already have him. And let's let's look at my stats with this card, okay? I am batting... Here, let me turn off face cam for a second. I in 19 games and 43 at-bats. This Part of this was BR, but I am batting... 488 with him, 8 home runs, 20 RBIs, and 21 hits. Now, in my books, that's crazy. It may not be crazy for you, but for me, it, it's crazy. So, I am kind of mad that they did that, because now regular belly price is going to go down. Just a tad bit. Let's see how much he's gone for now on the auction house. Or market, whatever you call it. My game is being super laggy right now. Either because of the um, update or I don't know. The Bellinger's still gone for 150k, so that's good. But this card we're gonna see a lot of. There's June, boys. Now let's look at all the cards we got. Who is the first card we got? Mike Zunino. Great power catcher. Actually, this catcher looks pretty good. If you don't, if you don't got the Gary Sanchez, like this card. If you're looking for, like, just someone to come off your bench in, like, an all-star game, he'd be good. Jesus Ad Ad Aguilar. You know, let me just turn on face cam for all this. Here, let me get back to, um, Mike Zunino stats. There y'all go. Y'all can see that. And here's Jesus Aguilar. 85, um, and 100 versus righties. 1 of 3, 93 against lefties. 48 vision and horrible fielding. He might be a solid just like bench bat. I don't know. Chase Anderson. Now, this card, I've not looked at any of these cards. He's got a four seam a sinker, a circle change, a curveball, and a cutter. So basically the basic pitches. And MLB the show 20 this year. And pitch speed differential actually doesn't look that bad. This card, depending on his uh, motion, he could be deadly or he could be an eh. Now, DJ LeMahieu. This card. It looks, it looks pretty good, boys. It looks pretty solid. But, I would not do him over Correa unless his swing is that good. His stats don't look that good. His fielding is pretty good, but he doesn't have a good arm. And look, now we got a green lightning bat. So, that's cool. So, this is the one we've all been waiting for. Y'all might have already seen the stats from someone else's, but let's look at it. Boys. Boys, 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 boys. Let me show y'all my face. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah. Me too. The, the card stats, th they're just too good. This card, this card's gonna be too good for the game. Now. Is he going to be better than Trout is going to be the big question. No doubt is this guy going to be in my lineup. No doubt is he playing on my team. Now, that's just the regular version. Let's go look at the prestige. If he reaches 99, I think he has potential. Where is he? Wait a second. Let me turn on face cam again. Let's look, is he getting breached in 99? Oh, it's only 98. Oh, I thought we were going to see our first prestige. Or, uh, first 99 player of the month card. But holy, boys. Holy. Holy, boys. 111 pop against righties. 108 against lefties. Just for comparison, his live series card has 88 in 85 power against righty and lefties. That's insane. In 96 fielding. So on this version of the card, he's gonna have diamond fielding anywhere. That's crazy. This is crazy, boys. Now, he's definitely going on my main squad. No doubt about that. Now, let's see what you have to do to prestige him. You have to get 87 hits, 41 extra base hits, 58 RBIs, and 50 runs with him. 
like, I'm not one to, like, say anything. I'm not one to, like, judge or anything, but I just think he could, I think he has potential to take out Trout on the people who got Mickey Mantle. Now, Bellinger's definitely going on my squad. Like, no doubt about that. But, I didn't look at, um, what you had to do to actually get him. Why'd I get here? I don't know. Bellinger might be the best one we get all year. So you can get hits with Mariners, RBIs, defeat CPU, and exchange. Exchanging? These cards, the golds are going to be going for a lot of stubs right now, boys. A lot of stubs. So, if you're not doing these, if you're not going to, like, go for Bellinger, I don't know what you're doing. It's up to you. And then the moments. Here, let's go look at all the moments. The moments are what really matter. Well, this is insane, boys. Like, I'm not going to play any moments for y'all in this video. But. Let's look at them. Three hits, one extra base hit. That shouldn't be hard. One home run. That should be, be easy. Six hits, three extra base hits. That might be kind of hard. Two extra base hits. That should be pretty easy. And two hits, one home run. So these don't look that hard. Three hits, one home run. Two extra base hits. That two home... Okay, this one might be a little hard, but not really. Wait, last one? Oh, okay. <laughs> so right now, none of these are looking that hard. That one's just... Gonna, these are going to be time-consuming. Not a fan of that. And DJ LeMahieu. So none of these look that hard. It just looks time-consuming on this one. Looks like the Agil Agilar ones can be the easiest. But yeah. Comment down below if you think this was a W or an L. I personally think this is a W by all means. Getting freaking Bellinger, boys. Oh my gosh, I love this card. Yeah, we'll go ahead and do an exchange. Because I already know I'm getting him. Two of him. I should have plenty. But, for all I know, I might not get it. As you can see, boys, I'm only prestige level 2. I should be up to at least, like, 3, maybe 4 by the end of the moment. I have 6 of a card? Wow. But, boys, like, I just get packs, so that's how I always, like, usually have players to do exchanges, because you get a lot of packs throughout the game. And this is only 35 instead of, like, the, uh, 50,000 for the team affinities. And I actually think this is pretty fair, if we're being honest. To get Bellinger, you just have to do this exchange how many times? Like five times? It's pretty good. I'm trying not to use silvers, but it looks like I will have to. Oh, I definitely have enough. There we go. Do I have any more no cells? Doesn't look like it, so let's go take out some guys. So we can go take out both of him, and we can take out 220 or 233. Oh, perfect. Exactly 35,000. So we do that, and there we go, boys. Got 500 stubs, so you are going to make some stubs throughout this, too. I'll go ahead and play one moment just to make this longer, or let's go look if they add anything, if they added anything else. Oh, yeah, Moonshot. Moonshot event. Okay. I forgot about that. So it doesn't look like there's any players you can get from this. Like, specific players. I think that's kind of, um... I don't know how I feel about this, actually. I mean, lots of packs, but... Nothing guaranteed that's too, too good. You can get Nate Pearson, who's gone for 20k. Look, there's four different ways to get him. Set so 2, you can Kopech is probably going to, yeah, 10k. You can get Casey Mice, who's going for 12k. And yeah. So in my opinion, the event, left-handed hitters, bronze right-handed pitcher. Boys, this is going to be a moonshot fest. So you can't use any lefty starter. You can't use any left. Wait, no, you can. If they're common. 
I got some moonshot people on my squad that I can do. This is gonna be a really fun event. And it, it makes the event fair. Not really. It gives people who actually grind the game a big advantage. Here, look, y'all wanna see the team I can have? Let's look. So, I'm gonna put Willie on the bench, Matt Olson on the bench. At second base, we got Dietrich, third base. Soto's definitely on my team. Uh, Dunn's on my bench. Giambi. I want a Bellinger on my main. Yeah, definitely right there. And in right field, we're also going to put... No, we're going to put you right there. We're going to switch these two's positions. And there you go. That's basically what my team would look like if I actually played. And then put one more, like... I'd put, like, a speech on the bench. But, yeah. Really solid team. <laughs> and I don't... Like, this is definitely going to be a moonshot fest, if you ask me. But... Comment down below what you think of the event, and what you think of the new uh, monthly awards programs. And comment down below how you're doing in ranked. I've been having a rough time. I think I'm like 2 and 3 in the season. Oh no, I'm 3 and 4, my bad. But still, I'm struggling. But yeah, make sure you guys like this video, subscribe if you're new. Um, comment down below what you think of the event. I know I've said that like 20 million times, but... I mean it. Also, make sure to go check out my Twitch channel, which is down in the link in the description. And I'll see y'all in the next video, boys. Peace out.